Hey Torres, Sunny, and this is your weekly for the week of August 3rd, 2015. So if you would like a reading from me, the link is always in the description box below. And after each video, I always have a picture sitting where my website is. So keep in mind that these are just general readings. And if I don't touch based on your situation, you can always check me out. Like I said, my email is below. And you can order a reading from me um, to see if we mesh. I do charge um, per question. And then I have my other packages. So one question is just $18, which is like really, really cheap compared to everybody else. So, yeah. I'm still doing the two um, extended videos for the two zodiac signs who receives the most liked and viewed video. So if you receive the most viewed, I'm going to give a detailed weekly insight regarding the um, beginning, mid, and end of that week. Um, and for the zodiac sign who receives the most liked video, I'm going to talk about your career, your love life, and or your finances. I will upload those videos either Friday or Saturday. So let's say from Taurus, did I have any visions for you guys? I did. I saw a torso. Um, when I say torso, it's as we know, like you need to, you know, be strong and support your back. Like be your own backbone. Maybe you want others to be your backbone. Or maybe you need to be other people's backbones. Um, but I saw like a slit right here. And your heart is right here. Yes, it's right here. It's not right here. Okay, it's in the middle. So a lot of you, like you feel as if your heart is wounded. Um, you feel as if you're trying to like repair your heart. So, you know, be mindful of that. Alrighty, so I'm not going to lie to you. Um, this is really interesting because so far, the Aquarius, the Pi, and the Pisces... I received their card in their reading and I received your guys card in this reading as well so this week is, is all about you and trying to repair yourself and trying to like just you know be the support for yourself I am picking up that some of you like you feel really indecisive towards your finances um, you feel like you're struggling you feel like you don't really know what to do if not your finances you feel as if your foundation is crumbling you feel as if like things are getting worse and you just don't know what to do you're kind of playing this victim mentality you're like oh my god what is going on things went left like what am i supposed to be doing honestly understand that help is on the way i am feeling like help is there in your face you just need to be mindful of the resources you need to either pray to your god and your angels for these resources or ask people um i am picking up that some of you like you you do feel ab abandoned um, and you just don't know what to do. I hate to say this. I do see that some of you, like, you may get kicked out of your home. Or you may have to move. Um, unwillingly. Like, you you just, I am picking up on, like, abandoned men. Like, moving, like, even if you don't want to. I am also picking up on illness. Um, but I, I feel like, you guys, you can't be in this depression mode. I mean, I understand where you're coming from, you know, to struggle and, you know, to feel as if you had your own back and to feel as if things aren't working out for you, you know, and you wanted that happy home and happy family and you wanted things to be awesome. But I mean, like, apparently you're going through it for a reason. There's a lesson that you must learn from it. So realize this lesson. Stop focusing on the bad and, you know, sit down and say, I'm going through this for a reason. My God wants me to you know be a stronger person because of this obstacle so god what am i meant to learn from this how can i grow from this and once you do that help will be there for you you will see yourself transform into something beautiful um because this is tying into an ending like when people struggle there this lets me know like there's an ending to a certain situation but you need to fight through to gain access to that new chapter you can't just give up when things get tough all right so keep moving forward however i do feel like some of you like you just are going to feel really indecisive um some of you like you may drive to clear your mind be mindful of driving um uh, on curves especially on rainy rainy days be careful about that um i am picking up some of you like your spirit and your well-being a, a lot of unexpected changes you really don't know what to do. You you just really don't know what to do. Some my nose keeps itching. Be careful of nosy people, and don't stick your nose in business that doesn't have to deal with you. All right. I'm also picking up that if you were married or if you were engaged, a lot of shakeup involving, you know, those uh, relationships. So be careful about that. 
I am picking up that there's going to be some sort of shake up within your spirituality. Don't say bad things about your God and your angels and the universe because it's going to come back to you 10 times fold, if not 100 times fold. So, you know, like, don't, you know, don't get upset because things are working out for you and you question your God and your angels to why you're going through the situation. Um, I am picking up that honestly, this is going to be stronger. You just need to realize that. I, you, your finances will get better though. It honestly will. You just need to take a closer look at what it is that you're going through. Stop holding certain things up at a pedestal because once you put that thing down and you really see the big picture and you see things for what they really are, things will start to find a balance for you. Things feel like this. And it's just like, oh my God, I don't know what to do. But once you take those rose colors and glasses off and you remove that thing that you held up at a pedestal, things will slowly start to balance itself out. And that's what you want. I am picking up uh, doo -doo 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 -doo. Uh, around October-ish is when things will get a little bit better for you guys. I'm picking that up. October is about to be here. So, yeah. Um, you need to pay attention to your body. Please don't let depression creep over you because I am picking up that it is going to affect you. It is. Um, if you are tied into a Libra, I feel like maybe this person owes you money. Or you need to see the bigger picture with this Libra person. Stop looking at the details. Stop looking at the details and just see the bigger picture. Um, see this person for what they really, really are. Um, if you have any court issues, I am picking up that you're going to have to give money. So, I mean, it is what it is. If you are tied into an earth sign person, earth signs are Capricorn, another Taurus, and Virgo. There needs to be some, this may be tying into you, there needs to be some sort of balance or justice or fair treatment involving you and this earth side person, if not yourself. Alright, you have room to grow new things. This is why I'm seeing the shake up. You need a new atmosphere, you need a new platform to build the things that you want. Alright, because the things that you want really isn't messing, is it, is it really meshing with the, with the platform that you already have right now, especially with the things that you already have on it, because it's kind of messing things up for you. That's what I, I want to say, messing. Yeah, it's really, it's not meshing, and it's messing things up for you. So yeah, but the message of this week for you guys, a lot of people was getting this card, or this card is like showing up within the reading. Um... The chariot move forward the best way that you can this is singing to me saying you need to move forward you can't be on the fence it's black and white either you want to do it or you don't and if you don't then it is going to be catastrophe and chaos for you so just be mindful about that but honestly move forward the best way that you can i am picking up that you know things that you went through in july you need to let that go all right i am picking up on some delays i am my torres but just turn that around Turn that around. Gain the mindset of I can do it. I'm struggling, but I'm going to do it. If I want to see brighter days, I'm going to have to get out of this darkness, all right? Like, sunshine days are not going to come to you if you decide to just stay in that cave, all right? You're going to have to find your way out of the darkness to see that sunlight. So, yeah. So, try to have a good week this week, my Torres, and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.